Welcome, fellow Mac users, ready to dive into some troubleshooting magic. How to fix MacBook stuck on spinning globe. Have you ever found yourself staring at that spinning globe on your MacBook, wondering what on earth is going on? Well, you're not alone. It's a common issue that many users encounter. Fear not, because today we're diving deep into the world of troubleshooting to help you get your MacBook back up and running smoothly. Let's dive in and get your MacBook back in tip-top shape. Start by shutting down your MacBook completely. This simple restart can sometimes resolve the issue. If you're dealing with a frozen app, then click on the Apple icon in the top left corner of your screen. Click on the Force Quit from the drop-down menu. A window will pop up showing all open applications. Select the one that's unresponsive and click Force Quit to close it. Check your Mac's CPU usage and open the Activity Monitor. Click on the search at the top right to open the spotlight. Search for Activity Monitor and click on it to open. Once it's open, keep an eye on the CPU tab to see which processes are using the most resources. If any are hogging too much, consider quitting them by selecting them and clicking the X button. If your Mac is running low on disk space, it could be causing the spinning wheel issue. Try to clear the disk space by removing some unnecessary files. Don't forget to empty your trash and delete any unnecessary downloads. Simply right-click on the trash icon in your dock and select Empty Trash to permanently delete its contents. Finally, make sure to close any background apps that may be running unnecessarily. Go to System Preferences, then click on the Users and Groups, and then click on Login Items to see which apps are set to launch automatically when you start your Mac. Disable any that you don't need by selecting them and clicking the minus button. By following these steps, you should be able to troubleshoot and resolve the issue of your MacBook being stuck on the spinning globe. Please like this video and subscribe for more helpful tech tips on Mac. Thanks for watching, Mac lovers.